In this session, we will talk about creating a database folder and starting MongoDB database. This is Hassan Mir from 02ProTraining.com. The installation of MongoDB is pretty simple. We have downloaded the file in the previous sessions and we have extracted the required components into a special folder. So that is the installation. There is no installer as such. And now we need to do some setup of the environment before we can start the database. All we need to do is create a folder that will hold our database files. You can create any folder. However, this is the default location that MongoDB expects to be there for the database. Now I'm going into my start menu, all programs, accessories and command prompt. Right click on the command prompt and choose run as administrator. Now I'm going to navigate to the root cd backslash change directory backslash now I'm going to create here directory using mkdir command I'm going to call it data and I'm going to go into data directory using change directory command and here I'm going to create another directory mkdir is the command and I'm going to call it db so now I have a db directory within data so dir is the listing to launch the database, it's a pretty simple command. You issue the command mongod from the bin folder that exists within the mongodb folder. However, the command needs to know where your database is residing into which folder you want to store your data. If you're using the default folder, then this is the command. I created a folder at default location, which is this location. Now, if you have created a folder in an location other than default location then you need to explicitly specify the location using this parameter db path so you're going to shoot the same command mongod dot exe and then space dash dash db path space and then issue the path here and if your path happens to have spaces then do not forget to put double quotes around the path now I need to navigate to the MongoDB folder, so cd backslash will take me to the root, cd space mongodb is going to take me to the MongoDB folder, here I'm going to do the listing dir, this is the folder we created during the installation. Now we have a bin folder within MongoDB, so I'm going to go cd space bin enter, now I'm going to do the listing dir, so all these commands are there within the bin folder. Now I'll issue the command mongod this will start the database you see here the message waiting for connections on port 27017 now database service is up you need to make a connection to the database service that is what we are going to talk next and this service should be up before a connection could be established just for your information, if you're not too much familiar with the uh, online commands, you could have just typed in this whole command directly without navigating to that folder like I did, cd space mongodb, then cd space bin, and then I only entered this command rather than the whole command. You could enter this whole command if you are sitting in a different folder. Based on the security settings of your computer, you might see an alert. You must click on allow access to proceed further. However, you need to make sure you're on a private network, not on the public network. 